So let's now create one counter app using the use reducer hook. So the use reducer hook takes one reducer function and one initial state. It returns the state and the dispatch function. So the initial state will be one object with the count value 0. So the reducer function takes the current state and one action object. So we are going to use the switch case and we are going to switch between the action type. So if the action type is increment then we are going to return one new state which contains the count with the value increased by 1. So we are going to access the previous state count value and we are going to increase this by 1. And in a case where the type is decrement then we are going to return count with the state value decreased by 1. So here we are going to create one h2 to show the value of the count state dot count. And also to increase and decrease the value we are going to need the button. So the first button will increase the value. So we have to use the on click handler. So on click of this button we are going to dispatch and here while dispatching we have to pass the action type. So here we are going to pass one object with the type. So here because we are incrementing so the type will be increment. So the dispatch type will determine whether the state count will increase or decrease. So we are going to create another button. So here we are going to decrement the value. The action type will be decrement. So here we have the count initial value is 0 and we have two buttons one to increase the value and another one to decrease the value. So let's now create another button which will reset the value. Let's just add another button. This will reset the value. So here the dispatch type will be reset. So here in the switch case we have to write if the case is reset then we are going to return the initial state where the count value is 0. So here we have a reset button also. So here we can increase the value, we can decrease the value and also we can reset the value to the initial count. So here we have created one simple counter app using this use reducer hook. So we can use this hook and we can manage and handle a lot complex state logics. So that's it for the video. See you in the next one. Take care.